Hollows like this are found only on Mercury. The irregular depressions are formed when there is an outgassing on the planet's surface. Messenger discovered these and other features on the surface of the innermost planet in our solar system. Mercury is three times closer to the sun than Earth is. When the NASA probe arrived back in 2008, more than half of the planet's surface was completely uncharted. Over a period of four years, Messenger carefully and systematically examined the smallest of the rocky planets. It had seven instruments on board. Over the course of the mission, flybys got closer and closer, and the probe was able to take highly detailed images. Other systems analyzed the planet in different wavelengths. The camera tells you the overall design and uh, structure. The spectrometer tells you something about the mineral composition and the atomic composition of the atmosphere. It's a very, very thin atmosphere called an exosphere at Mercury. The most pressing questions the researchers wanted to answer were how did the planet form and how has it changed over time? Mercury is remarkable in many ways. For instance, it's subjected to radiation levels ten times what they are here on Earth. A day on the blasted planet lasts 176 Earth days, but a year only lasts half as long. Mercury is pretty small, just a little larger than our moon. On the side facing the sun, temperatures can rise to about 430 degrees Celsius. On the dark side, they can plunge to minus 170. Putting together a giant digital puzzle from thousands of images, the researchers on the team painstakingly constructed a map of the planet in different spectra. That data allowed them to make a mineralogical survey of the surface. The map is helping the researchers understand more about how planets form and develop. We can't determine that here on Earth because we have water and erosion. In other words, the original state was altered again and again. But on Mercury, you don't have that. There, you can still see the material that terrestrial planets were originally made of. The biggest surprise was that Mercury's surface differs in a key way from the other rocky planets. It contains large amounts of volatile elements like sulfur and chlorine. The mission also settled another question that has plagued generations of researchers. Was the planet at some point volcanic? Smooth valleys like this were certainly formed by sheets of hot, quickly spreading lava. In 2012, Messenger also made a remarkable discovery at the planet's northern pole. At the bottom of craters that are always in shadow, buried beneath a dark layer of material that also contains organic molecules, the probe detected ice. Both could have been brought here by asteroids or comets, wanderers from the far reaches of the solar system that at one point slammed into the planet's surface. If all goes as planned, Mercury will soon be receiving another visitor from Earth. In 2017, a joint European-Japanese mission called Bepi Colombo, made up of two satellites, We'll lift off for the inner solar system to pick up where Messenger left off. <laughs> 